Hi kids! Welcome to our Sunseeker Summer Series Ministry Minute. I'm Sheila. And I'm Julia. Today is actually our last week doing our Summer Series Ministry Minutes. Yeah, I know. We've had so much fun learning and discovering more about God and His love for us. I'm going to miss doing this. Me too. So today, for our last session, I want to talk to you all about being brave. Now that summer is over and you guys are all heading back to school, and for some of us, that can be a little scary sometimes. A new classroom, new friends, and I know things are going to be a little different this year going back to school because of the virus. Maybe that can make you feel a little nervous. I feel nervous sometimes when I go to a place and I don't know anyone. It can feel kind of lonely. And I also must confess that I'm a little bit scared of spiders and creepy crawly things. Mm -hmm. I'm scared of falling, so I don't really like heights. We can be scared of a lot of different things. Raise up your hand at home if you ever feel afraid. So I want to show you guys something about fear. I brought along this little candle, which you can light, okay. and this balloon. So when we get scared, we can be like this balloon and feel like things are too overwhelming and that sometimes we just want to sometimes. Jesus said in John 16 verse 33, I have told you these things so that in me you can have peace. In this world you will have trouble, but take heart for I have overcome the world. So what should we do when we're afraid? So Psalm 55 verse 22 says to cast your cares upon the Lord and he will sustain you. So we can pray and give our fears to the Lord and pray that he takes our fears away. So when we pray does that mean bad things will never happen? No, unfortunately we live in a sinful world and bad things will happen sometimes. We need to trust in God with all of our problems. I brought this balloon with a cup of water in it. The water in this balloon represents God. And if we let God take our fear and ask him for strength and to be brave, let's see what happens with the flame. The balloon won't pop. That's right. God will strengthen us and help us to become brave even in a scary or stressful situation. There will be times when you don't feel brave at all. Times when you don't feel like God is near or that he's not listening. Your fears may seem too big and too strong, but there is one who is greater than all of the fears in this world. God is greater and God is with us. God will give us the strength and the courage to face our fears. So kids, what are some ways we can feel God's presence with us when we're worried or afraid? Verses we have memorized from the Bible come into our minds and give us comfort. My favorite verse comes from Joshua 1 verse 9, which says, Be strong and courageous. Do not be terrified. Do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Sometimes when we're quiet in prayer, we can hear Jesus' words in our hearts, or sometimes a lesson or a song that we hear contains the exact words of what we need to hear in that moment to remind us how to be brave and trust God in all situations. And we also have family and friends surrounding us with love and caring for us, and we know that God is using them to help comfort us. Well, our time is already up for today. Kids, before we go, we just wanted to let you know that we're praying for you and we're thinking of each and every one of you. Yeah, we miss you guys. Bye. Bye.